Hi, I'm Steve Warrell from Georgia State Plan. We're an estate planning and probate law firm serving Woodstock and Marietta, Georgia and the surrounding areas. I often hear questions about whether and how often you need to review your estate planning documents. So that's what I'm gonna talk with you about today. I have an old estate plan. That's okay, right? The short answer to this question is probably not. Estate planning is not a one and done task. It's an ongoing process. In general, as your life changes, so should your estate plan. So it's important to review your estate plan periodically and revise it as needed to make sure that it lines up with your current wishes and continues to serve your estate planning goals. How often should you review your estate plan? You should review your plan at regular intervals. Depending on your age, this might mean every three to five years. Now, we recommend every three years as a bare minimum, or maybe every milestone birthday. As part of these regular reviews, think about your current estate plan and ask, who benefits? Is everyone you want to benefit accounted for? Are there people named in your estate plan that you no longer want to receive a part of your estate? Are all of your assets and property included in your estate plan? Who's in control? Who is designated as your financial agent, your healthcare agent, the guardian of your minor children? Are you still comfortable with all of these designations? Do you still trust these people? Depending on the answers to these questions, you may want to revise your estate plan. In addition to these regular reviews, you should review your estate plan anytime there are significant life events, such as a change in your marital status, your family status, or your employment status a change in your health or the health of your spouse or other family members, a change in your financial situation or your long-term financial goals, a change of residence if you move to another state, a change in circumstances involving the person named as guardian for your minor children, or a change in circumstance involving the person designated as your agent for financial affairs or healthcare decisions should you become incapacitated. Any one of these life events is likely to trigger a need to revise your estate plan. So how do you go about doing that? There are specific procedures and best practices for making changes to each of the components of your estate plan. What works best for you will depend in part on your specific circumstances, but there are a few ground rules that apply across the board. Here are some of those ground rules. Treat your original estate planning documents with great care. Don't unstaple the originals or remove them from your binder to make copies or to remove or add pages. In our office, we put scanned copies of your documents on a flash drive so you can print them out as needed. Never make any handwritten changes to any of your estate planning documents. Handwritten changes are likely to be ineffective and even worse, may void the entire document completely. Review your beneficiary designations. This step is often overlooked, but it's important to review your beneficiary designations on your life insurance and retirement accounts as part of your estate planning review. Make sure these designations are consistent with the rest of your estate plan and that they don't cause adverse tax effects or other unintended consequences for you or your beneficiaries. Don't put it off. If you know you need to revise one or more pieces of your estate plan, do it as soon as possible. Delay opens the door to unexpected events that might frustrate your intentions. Reach out to an estate planning attorney. There are specific rules that must be followed in drafting and executing an estate plan. Those same rules apply to revising your estate plan and you have to follow the rules. The legal and practical consequences of making a mistake can cause family disharmony and confusion and can undermine all your careful planning and good intentions. There's just too much at stake to risk a do-it-yourself revision. Please, love your family enough to do it right so that they won't have to suffer from your bad mistakes. If changes in your life have made it necessary to change your estate planning documents, please seek the advice of an experienced estate planning attorney. If you have questions about reviewing or revising your estate plan or estate planning generally, we have answers. Call us at 770-425-6060 to schedule a discovery session with us at no charge. I'm Steve Worrell.